leans quite well. Jesus Christ. Let's have a look at. Can't see me from busting off. I shouldn't tell you that, should I really? <laughs> <laughs> I can't see where I'm going, Jack. <laughs> 27 degrees, we're not on a side slope. There you go. Might go a little bit more. 28, there we go. 20, oh, 29. Jesus. So, so it, it leans quite well. If you rush it, then it becomes possibly a little bit dangerous. But if we go nice and slow. Actually, these, they all roll. So oh, that, God. So, so they're not plumbed. Well, why hasn't that done that? I'm going to use hill descent control. So I've got the arrow down as low as I can go. All I'm going to do, I'm going to edge forward a little bit until I can see properly because it's quite bright. And that's it. Look on the camera so you can see under see, the bumper. So you can see down the, down the bottom there. And then I'm going to go feet off the pedals. Feet off the pedals. Feet off the pedals. And actually the car Whoa. does the braking for you. So it's looking for grip. It's using the ABS system. You're going to hear the ABS working now, can't you? Yes. And I've, I've still not braked. But we've, we've crawled down there. Yeah, Actually, I'm in the bush now. It's, not really good. Um, it's gone down at three and four miles an hour. Incredible. And you get to the bottom. Under lots of control. The wheels have always been rotating so I can steer. Because if, if you lock the wheels up, the front will suit it. lower us in but once it's smooth again you might go along and tick over or you might want a little bit of throttle and do that down to yourself I won't tell you off for going too slow I might tell you off for going too fast that's any okay, that's any difference but the sun is running a bit weird so a bit of, bit of a side slope maybe this I'm gonna be higher than you yeah so favor the right hand side because if anything's going all right eight and you ease your foot off the accelerator the chances are that the brakes will apply. So instead of getting that normal little bit of engine braking, yeah. uh, hill descent will put the brakes on for you and slow you down that a little bit quicker. But the fact we're crawling at the moment, it's, it's, it's your control with the pedals. That's it. It's quite wet here. I, I would it's, actually, it's flowing. Yeah. See, see the little stream? Starts off as a little tiny trickle, and then we can go into a bit deeper water. Yeah, this is famous, this bit here. Yeah, that's it. So, nice and slow through. So yeah, the, the, the feeling is that if you make a bow wave, there's a couple of things wrong with that. If you're out here, we, we have geese nesting right. in, in this river. They, they nest right next to it. If we go too fast, we're going to wash them out. Yeah. Okay. If you're in, the, if you're in town, chances are you're going to put all the water through Granny Miggins' window <laughs> after, after she's barricaded her kitchen door. <laughs> but the other thing, if you're in towns, concrete and brick, yeah. if that wave hits it, comes back. Instead of being in shallower water, you're in deeper water. Oh, yeah. So the, the technique used to be, send a bit of a bow wave, Behind that is a bit of a trough, and you drove in the you trough. You go deeper. Oh, yeah, is the theory. This but, is but, but the thing is, you're, oh. you're in. Um, see the cameras underwater there. Or, or was it taken again? So we're not. What I don't know is whether oh, mine on, still needs power weights. Let's put the um, weights into them. Let's see, let's see what it's like. Take, take a second bit too. There you go. So it's like a um, reversing sensor. The deeper it gets, the more urgent that tone will become. So it stops you having to stare so at it. So it's now above the door, sealed up. Yeah. You wouldn't want to open the doors now, because I think we'd take a bit of water on. Which is that seal on the back of mine that's worked loose that I need to replace. So yeah. This is when it would matter. I like the lighting in the doors. That's probably up to the, up, up to the hook. That's a typical woman to comment now, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I'm videoing this. <laughs> this is fantastic. So yeah, we're probably, um, that's put quite an accurate representation looking at the, at the wheels. We're above the, above the hub, certainly. Straight on down, and this is where the geese were nesting. They, they, they've we're gone first back down, and have another go. So nice and steady, see what if it manages. Stay in the rut, that's it. And just keep it like that, see if it's going to go. I'm going to get a bit of wheel spin, we'll see if it's going to spin the wheels. We do. We'll keep edging forward, keep covering the brake, until we can see what's happening properly with ourselves. There it goes. Right. The back. So stop, stop there. You can see it goes down a hill, mm -hmm. and it actually what it does it goes around to the left, and then it goes sharp left. Try and do it without. You ready? Okay. Feet off the pedals. Off, off, off. And just keep us in the track. See it goes around. So don't break. Yeah, don't break. Don't break. Don't break. No. And then. Brilliant. Well done. It's quite, it's quite tight. This you might not really. Mm -hmm. Okay. Around to the right, please. So we've been in quite a bit of wet and it's not been too bad, but it's gonna it's gonna be muddier and a little bit bumpier now. So you're gonna to have to pick your line, 
or not so much your line, but you have to choose your, your paddle control is going to have to be really good. So this is only a couple of inches deep, but it's worth going in nice and slow like you have done because you don't hurt it. It's pretty. Some strange, well not strange, but it's quite unusual greenery around, isn't it? Mm. Quite sort of. It feels almost tropical, doesn't yeah, it? So yeah, I think, I think that's why they call it a jungle track. Yeah. Ooh. When you get to that junction, Dave, just around to the right, please. Where we came in. Yeah, we did. We're going to go against the flow for a 20 yards or so. It was built for um, Trek and not, not Trek, um, the, the Camel Trophy and the um, yes. G4, etc. This was the selection area. Okay. So basically, they camped. They put they put a load of tents in the middle of this, and people lived in them for two weeks. Um, yeah, G4 took over from Camel, didn't it? Yeah, that's right. And then, um, sorry, just take that. Go away, don't know. One brake drive system. Point of um, your, your viewpoint there. We're going to do a very very sharp right. You might have to have a shunt at it. And we're going to follow that card down. So we can watch what they do. So when they move forward from there, using the foot brake, so you can see the two marks on the yeah. on the bridge there. So you want the wheels on there roughly, nice and steady. And you, all you can do is you're, you're going to inch it forward until it starts to tip. Once it starts to tip, Stop. put put the foot on the brake and, and hold us there until it's down. It's not going to tip until we are we are at least level with these um, pillars. So nice and gently. You're getting there now. Slow, slow, slow. This is the bit. Where's it going to go? Half your time again. Hey. Just warm. Is it seized? There it goes. <laughs> <laughs> there it goes. Nice and gently down. That was lovely. Well done. That's just got a bit of water in the brain. You're right on the limit there. That's it. Should we do a slope? Yeah, that's Good it. Job. You might want a bit of throttle now, even. So that's probably that's probably mud and ruts holding first gear. If you're in, if we went into grass, gravel, snow, um, it will it will change up a gear. It makes it. Where we go? Let's um, we, put up a big uh, pothole, shall we? Yeah, let's go for it. So nice and steady. Again, good good pedal control. Here, Dave, and you'll you'll make it nice and easy through the middle of that one. Okay. So drop the left leg, left wheel into that hole, and the right wheel into that hole. So you might even look, that's that's it. That's the line. Nice and steady. And, and almost come, keep follow this hedgerow almost in effect. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Hey! <laughs> Straight the steering again. That's it. You got me comedy, Dave. I don't know what to do with that. I'm going to clean it off now. <laughs> I'll do it for you. I don't yeah. mind. <laughs> Aim for that sign. Yeah. yeah. Right, that's in the, in the bush. So yeah. Come to the right, and then we're going to spin right round to the left. Okay. We're going to do that twisted terrace. So this is the. Um, oh, the road all the Lock, 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 lock. That's yeah. it, you got it. Nice and steady now, at the top, just brings to a stop. We'll just double check we got the line right. Is your hill descent on and it's low? Yeah. Yes. It's hard to see in the in this light, Dave. You, you're about as far left as you want to go. Okay. You might want a bit of right turn in a little bit. We'll see how we get on. Lower us a little bit on the foot brake and we can just see where we're going. That's it, yeah, it's just a touch of right. That's it. That's not, not a lot, but that's it, lovely. Okay. Up here? Yeah. Can you see where we're going? Yeah. Keep steering straight. Feet off the pedals. Gives a little bit of speed up. Keep steering straight. That's it. Okay, Jackie? Yeah. It's going to swap over now. This wheel's off the floor, in effect. And then it comes back down. Because it, it, if you look, when we get to the bottom, if you look back, you can see that you can't really see it coming down, but there's a big twist in the middle of it. So as it changes from one twist to the other, the wheels come off the floor. I'm about to pull that down with a bit of throttle. Yeah, towards the very end you do, don't you? Oh, this is good. Yeah. You've changed your dash. That's, that, that's a new new head up um, track. So this is a, a quite a good ditch. Yeah. So you need to cross it at roughly 45 degrees. If you stop, stop, that's it. That angle there is a roughly 45. If you watch them, we're going to follow them. So this is an opportunity to skip. Actually, we concrete it through it. So don't get too close. If they don't make it, they need to come back. Yeah. So we don't we don't want to be using them using us as a brake. I just want to go a dip. Yeah. 
It goes up, and that's why we've got the air suspension as well. You get the clearance on that on that ramp, the ramp over, so we don't hit the floor. High angle and approach. Yeah. So nice and bit of it off here. No, that's it. So it doesn't take much to climb. You won't be able to see where you're going because the bonnet's going to come up. There you go. So quick check on there. That's fine. A little, that's bit clever, isn't it? a little bit of throttle. A little bit of throttle. That's it. Bonnet's going to come back down. Are they cleared? I think they have. Yeah. Now you can either brake down here or hill descent. <laughs> we'll get the right wheel spinning, then you have the left wheel, right wheel. At the top, yeah. they're opposite each other. So you, you, you both wheels are going to lose traction. And in fact, you might end up with three, three wheels going. You might have three wheels right. leave, yeah, depending on the length of the car. So the just wheel and steady and keep it going. So you have, an, again, enough momentum to keep it moving, not so fast that we go hurtling off it. You might find it starts to go to the side a little bit, but just keep the steering straight if you can. Okay, Ready? and if I say stop, just put your foot on When the you brake. say keep the steering straight, keep the front wheels yeah. pointing up the yeah. hill. Keep the front so as the car moves, you turn the wheels to point up the hill. Yeah. Right. Okay. A little bit more. That's it, keep it like that. Okay. Oh, I just made it over. Well done. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, shit. Stop, stop, stop. I didn't call that. Oh, shit. Quite close to the side there. So straight up now. Lower us down nice and gently with the foot brake a little bit. Get down the first step or two. That's, it's only because that's black. That's it. We've got plenty of room that side. And you can either drop. I'm drop, happy. Yeah. You can either hill descent or um or keep it on the foot. The, do the first bit on the on the brake and, and the control us down. Stopped. It's because it's, it's he got he's called gradient release control. Yeah. So what oh. happens is it, it, let, it lets the brake off really slowly, so there's a bit of a delay. And then this bit. <laughs> He'll just hold it now. Feel off the pedals. Not even feed it in. No, feed it. Feed, feed it off. That's I'm it. off. That's it. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. Well done. There we go. Um, now, the question is, could she climb back up? Well, go really into reverse then. Oh, I didn't. Keep this, the tr trick is to keep the, get the line right and then keep the steering straight. It's not too fast. But put a, and then feed, some, feed some power in there. Oh my goodness me! <laughs> That's it, he's off. That's it, we go forward now. So it's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> does it, does it? Wow! HDC, feet off. You can do it, yeah. Come on, baby. Oh. <laughs> over, that, over that little ramp. Yep. Then, and it goes straight on over the other side, like into that little bush area. Nice and steady. That's it. Until you, you're just getting adjusted to the light, isn't it? Yeah, that's a lot more useful. Yeah. It's gone back to some of the, It's gone back to that. Yeah, reversing. Right. Um, not reversing, it's gone there. The forward reversing, yeah. that makes sense. That's cool. Uh, turn around to the right, please. Now we go back and then go through that uh, nice bit of water to finish off. Oh, and there we go. Okay, mate, take the uh, break. British car auction Paragon who do the fleet work for Range Rover. Oh, right, okay. Land Rover. Yeah, yeah. So we occasionally get on their land at Upper Hayford and have a play. So, what, what business are you in, Dave? Office furniture. Okay. But it leads to all sorts of. Yeah, yeah. So, so you got um, your own business? And... Yeah, our business partner.